The Cardinals have really taken it to the Bobcats in the second half. After trailing at halftime 34 to 32, they have outscored the Bobcats by a 30 to 18 margin. So it's Beckwith re inbounding underneath. The starting five are still in the ball game for the Cardinals. And this is Beckwith to Barton being pressed by Maletta. Nice behind the back dribble, works it past half court. Now this is Coffin at the free throw line, picks up the ball above her head, swings it back to Barton. Barton back to Coffin. Coffin attempts to go up for the three, but is blocked by Lucy Sprung. Foul is called on Coffin. Perhaps a foul in frustration as Sprung was able to reject the shot from the 6-2 center, putting an exclamation point here on this second half as Sprung will head to the line and try and add to her game-leading point total. It's great defense there by Wesleyan. They knew that they had to defend at the three-pointer and were able to do so. Very aggressive on that three-point arc. That is the fifth foul called on Coffin, so she is done for the night. She heads off the court, throws her water bottle in anger into the corner, not happy with the performance of herself and her team here in the second half. Sprung hits the first free throw to increase the lead to 63 to 52. The second one also good. Sprung with 27 points, leading all scorers. And Wesley in a 12 point lead. The three is up by Beckwith, no good. Rebounded by Lowe. Gets it off to Savas. Bates not looking to foul anymore as they trail by 12. They know their fate is imminent. And said they will foul. Ninth, ninth team foul called on the Bobcats. And Bates just preventing the inevitable at this point. Free throw is up and good. Cardinals just extending this final total as they now lead it 65 to 52, 14.8 seconds to play. Second one is also good. Wesleyan now a 14 point lead. Bates playing it out to the end. Still trying to get off a good attempt at a three pointer. So with four seconds left, the three is up and good by Goodridge. And now the inbounds pass, and that will do it. The final score tonight, 66 to 55. The Wesleyan Cardinals able to come away with a big home victory. After trailing 34 to 32 at the half, they outscored the Bobcats 34 to 21 in the second half.